Alright, push onward. But dude, the dot is the real king here. I put those dots on the boss. Imagine if I had a DPS build with the dots. Holy. This is a tank build with the dot. And that thing just absolutely... Does it connect? It does not connect. We gotta go back. There's a pathway over here. We gotta go back, boys. Yep. It doesn't connect. That means there's probably an, an optional blast down here. That means I gotta go investigate. Yeah, you can see right below me. That was the other direction we could've went. We gotta go... It's gonna be kind of a long walk, but it's worth it, man. We don't know what kind of gorgeous loot could be down there. We must acquire the loot. This isn't looking good. Hey guys, I already killed you once. I'm just gonna run by you. I need to know what's down the other way. I gotta remember how to get there. I also need to heal. I realized my health was discombobulated. That's the only bummer. I don't really have a way of healing. Which way do I go? I go down. I just have the mod on my shotgun that lets me heal. I could put Doggo on healing duty, but then he's not going to be tanking or DPSing anything. This is the other way that we are going to take now. Let's see where this goes. Looks like it goes straight into a boss fight here, boys. But I just have no health, man. We're going to have to heal in the boss fight, dude. Unless these bandages heal me. But I think they just... Does anything give me health? I just... Bleeding. Mod power. Stamina. We're going to consume the bird poop. Yeah. Yeah, we gotta eat the bird poop. That's how it goes sometimes, boys. It doesn't look like this is a boss fight, actually. We got an amulet. Okay. They're under the ground, Billy. Got him? Nah, we're just gonna hit him with the shotty. Try and charge up our mods. Okay, we're charged up. Now we're gonna dot him. I'm just gonna use... Oh, I only had one grenade. Oh, he's already dead. Okay. Yeah. I think that's the real star of the show, is that dot, man. Anywhere else I can go? Why does this hole look so ominous? Can't go in there though. Alright, so we just came down here for this amulet. Let's see what it does. Increases all damage dealt by 2.5% for 10 seconds after killing an enemy. Stacks 10 times, dealing damage. Refreshes the timer. Stacks 10 times. That's literally... <laughs> you can just... As long as you're killing stuff, you can keep that. <laughs> okay, dude. Yeah. We, we, we might have to go for a damage build, dude. And just delete bosses. I mean, we're a tank build and we're deleting bosses, man. Holy smokes. That's pretty nuts. That's a really good aim. Not as good as my amulet, though. This gives me damage. 25% damage increase plus a 10% damage reduction. I think I just got lucky. Because I don't know if rings and stuff are random or not. 
They might not be. Maybe everybody gets all damage reducing items at first. Hey guys. Just gonna pass. Ooh, you do a lot of damage. Ooh, I might die. We need to rest at this thing here. Yeah, we need to rest here, boys. Holy smokes, I'm talking about being a tank and these guys just, these, uh, nothing minions just deleted my health bar, dude. Alright, now we progress. That was 100% worth going back for that. Because I do plan on playing through this on multiple difficulties because there's so many different things that can happen in that campaign. And so many things that I know that I missed. And I wanted to max out some archetypes. Which is going to require me to basically play through an entire campaign to max out one archetype. That's, that's what it took. Da -da 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 -da. Alright. <sighs> Onward we go. To the tree. Is this the final boss? Is this it? I think we're at the final boss, dude. This is the tree. This is it, guys. Are we ready? Are we gonna go in there with the level zero uh, engineer? <clears throat> yep, the blackened citadel. I think we are. I think we're going in with a level zero engineer and a level five handler. We're now under leveled. But here we go. The final showdown. <sighs> the root. What do you think is gonna be the final boss, guys? I think it's gonna have to do with Ford. Guess we're doing this the hard way. Wait! It won't work! Anomaly. Step aside. Hmm? You did it! We're here. This is our one chance. If we stop the route here, it's done. For good. Corruption eradicated. Okay. I can break the shield, but it'll take everything I've got. I'll be powerless. All right. Once we do this, there's no turning back. Either you win, or say it. Or it's the end of everything. Anomaly, your chance of success is greater than zero. Greater than zero. I was attempting to reassure you. Yeah, thanks. Very comforting. Come on, let's do this. Okay. Are you ready? What was that? That was weird. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> there we go, boys. Final showdown. Hopefully being under leveled isn't gonna matter. But I think it might, but eh, it'll be fine. She lost her power. That was her purpose. You must hurry. What if she lost all of her powers? Hey! 
Her only Traveler. purpose was to open the door for me. <laughs> Kick some ass for me. Uh, that's probably she's probably just has to regenerate, but okay. Well, um, goodbye, guys. Time to die. What the heck is going on in here, man? Hello. Housekeeping. Why doesn't the uh, the seeker guy help me? Okay. Is that a dragon? It's looking like a dragon, boys. That's a dragon. Oh, never mind. So it's a snake dragon. No, it's a dragon. I didn't think it had back legs. Alright, well, the annihilator. Annihilation. Alright, here's what we're gonna do, boys. We're gonna pop our shield. Our turret. Oh, dude, our turret is chunking, boy. Uh, but we're about to die. So. I need to. I. Uh. 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 Being under leveled might be a problem. I need to pop a relic, please. Or not. Okay, we might die here. Pop the relic. Oh, come on, man. It doesn't even. The game doesn't even give me enough time to pop my stupid relic, man. I'm dead. Did. Just let me pop my relic, dude. Okay, now we're golden, dude. We got two health bars. Bro. He did a lot of... What? Ugh. What just happened? Phase two? Yo, can I get a resupply? What the heck is going on here? I have no relics. Okay. Uh, what just happened? I have no idea what's happening right now. But, uh, we're, we're jumping between realities. Yeah, I need to actually process what the heck is happening right now. Cool. All right, we we have to have an actual heal. So I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna equip this bad boy. Fires an explosive round that deals up to 155 damage within nine meters, or we burn them. This does 14. This does 13. I'll go with this. Yeah. All right. Keep your gun loaded. And your so we're gonna get this as high as we can. And this size we can. Level eleven and level thirteen. Oh, well, let's see how this goes, boys. We're gonna try this again. <sighs> we have long range weapons now. And we switched up our classes. We're gonna see if this is gonna make the difference. Smart ammo, okay. All right, here we go. All right, we're gonna put down our turret. Pop a heal. Okay. Dude, that's such a cheap shot, man. We're just shooting every single bullet we have. Shoot every single bullet you stink and have, dude. Holy hell, did we finally stink and get it? I think we got it. Dude, that took so many stinking tries. 
Gosh, dude, that was insane. I had to change my whole stinking build. I had hoped it would not come to this. Come to what? Hey. Hey! There's gotta be a way! What are we doing here if there isn't a goddamn way? Only two outcomes for me. The corruption consumes us all. I didn't win. Keep. What's going on? Why? Why isn't it staying dead? The corruption is inviolable. Containment is no longer a viable option. The only outcome left is annihilation. To eradicate the corruption, the system must be restored. Okay. What the hell does that mean? It means wiping everything. Starting over. Starting over? I thought we were trying to stop that from happening. We have no choice. The root will destroy. No way. Everything. We lose after all that. Oh. Unexpected. I am reluctant to execute. Where's Ford at? No. Keep. There's another way. Traveler, on me. What's going on? Just happened. I gotta fight this thing again? There's no way. No stinking way, bro. What is happening? Ow. Okay, we got problems. <laughs> oh, she's dead, huh? My turret's still shooting at stuff right now. <laughs> Dude, where's Ford out of all, through all this? Uh-oh. Everyone's being erased. It's Ford. Hey, those guys were bad. Cause she's sucking everything in. <coughs> Absorbing all of existence. She sucked so much in that she exploded. Are you serious? It's gonna end like that? You gotta be kidding me. She sucked everything in and then exploded, and you're just gonna say, oh, that's the end. 
No way. There's got to be something after that. What? That's actually the end? It doesn't even tell you where Ford was the whole time? I'm actually, I'm actually not happy. What happens if I start this? Where does it put me? Okay. It puts me, I got a bunch of stuff that I unlocked, but what the heck happened? Is Ford back? No, he's not back. What the heck? It's not going to explain anything. Everybody's just going to blow up and then that's it. What happens if I go back to... Here, what happens? What the heck, man? What? Do I have to fight this thing all over again? Everybody's just gone? I'm so confused. So the game just ends with... Clementine sucks all of existence into her and then explodes and then that's it. Doesn't tell you anything about what happened with Ford. It doesn't tell you anything else. It doesn't even say, hey, nothing. Hold on, dude. Hold on, dude. We're gonna go... Here. There's gotta be some sort of cutscene that I'm missing here. That explains... Something. Anything. That just don't make no sense. No, they're just gone. What in Davy Jones? Uh, well, <clears throat> I guess that's where it leaves the story until the DLC comes out. If they're gonna make DLC, which they obviously have to make DLC because that didn't make no stinking sense. What the Davy Jones, man? Okay, well, I guess that's the game, guys. Maybe I missed something. But, uh, usually it says, you know, it gives you some sort of something to tell you what the heck happened, but it just left me on the biggest stinking cliffhanger. Ah, <sighs> well, uh, that's Remnant 2, boys. Let's see how long our playthrough was. I think it was around 13 hours. Dang, it took me 19 and a half hours, dude. To beat the game, boys. There you have it. There's Remnant 2. Do I recommend it? Absolutely. It was a stinking blast. It was a massive improvement over the first game. There's so many different builds. I haven't even unlocked all the archetypes. I don't know how many there are. And the fact that you can mix and match every single one of them and have all those different combinations is insane. That's a ton of replayability, not to mention that there's certain bosses that I didn't even get to see on my playthrough that are randomly selected as you're going through your playthroughs. Absolutely amazing game. Highly recommend it. But I will say there's two massive things that I find as cons, and that is this is probably only going to pertain to to the PC version but one is the game is built around FSR and DLSS which are things that are supposed to give old graphics cards a little bit of an extended life it's not supposed to be things that you have to use on high-end graphics cards to run the game and the second is that every time a new enemy that I've never seen in the game appears and every time they die 
I get that stutter because it has to load the shaders of the moves that the enemy makes. Those are my only two gripes of this game. And the stinking cliffhanger that just, just got thrown in our face. Man. Awesome game, though. Highly recommend. It was an absolute blast. Now I have to unlock all the archetypes. Look up some crazy weapons because now I've played through the game, so there's not really any spoilers other than the enemies I haven't fought yet. And I'll probably do some more playthroughs of the game. I don't know if I'll upload them, though. And, uh, yeah. Alrighty, guys. We'll have to see what's in store next. I'm not sure what game I'm going to play through next. Maybe Boulder Gate, Boulder's Gate 3, but I've never played one of those games. And it looks like that game is going to be like 400 hours long. So maybe not that game. Maybe we'll dive into another scary game because I had a blast playing through Summer at 58. Who knows? But thanks for watching, guys. Greatly appreciate it. Hope you guys have a good afternoon, good evening, good night, whatever it is, wherever you are. And I'll see y'all on the next one.